thought I'd better get this video in before it's too late. As you can see, I've got my December birch box right here. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are gonna be doing the December unboxing of my birch box. So it is the last day of December and I thought I'd better get this video in before it's too late. As you can see, I've got my December birch box right here. I absolutely love the colors of this. I love the box just in general, feels very good quality this month. I don't know if they put a little extra into it because it's Christmas time, but I absolutely love it. I love the colors. Um, I just love the whole Christmassy feel to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to open it up. Um, as you can see, it's kind of silver here. This is definitely a box I will reuse in the future. And then once you open it up, it comes in another tiny little bag, which again, very light, but does feel good quality, and it's just a drawstring. So I'll definitely reuse this for something, whether I just pop it in my handbag or something like that. So. Let's go ahead and see what we have today. Um, so this is basically, this just tells you all about the different products. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Just grab whatever comes first. So this, I believe, um, yes, this is the full size product. So in case you guys aren't familiar with Birchbox, they put about five items based on a survey that you've completed and they always include one full size item in it. So this, I believe, this looks like an eyeliner to me. Yep, it's a Fierce Flix eyeliner. Um, the retail price is 15 pounds, quite expensive for an eyeliner if you ask me, but lovely to get it as my full size item. Now this looks like it is completely environmentally free, environmentally friendly, sorry. Um, it's black, I believe. Yeah, and it's by a London company, which I always love. Um, so quite pleased with this. Um, I'm not in need of a new eyeliner, but I am pleased with it. I will link Birchbox info down below, and if you guys are interested in getting it, you can click on my link and you'll get 10% off, I believe, for your first um, purchase. Okay, the second item um, it says is a Laura Mercier. I absolutely love this line. I think they are such good quality and it looks like it, what is this? It's an eye stick in amethyst. You can see there. So it looks, oops, sorry, upside down. Um, it looks a bit as if it's like an eyeshadow, which is quite cool. Let's try that on. So that's the color of it. Oop, can you see that? That's the color of it. Um, and yeah, it's quite, I like this color very much so. I don't tend to wear a lot of eye shadow, um, but this is something that would be great to carry. Um, I have a little travel makeup bag that I keep inside my handbag, so products this size are great just to have kind of on the go, and this is definitely a color I would use. It's a very sort of warm, wintry tone, so I really do enjoy this very much, actually. And anything by Laura Mercier, I'm always happy to get. I absolutely love that product line. Okay, moving on. Oh, Benefit. Wow, I'm really liking this bag so far because these are some of my favorite lines. So this is Benefit, <laughs> the poor professional. Um, and it's basically, it says, it's a break in pore emergency, an invisible finishing mattifying gel. So, there you go, that's the size of it. Again, this is probably a, no, it's a 7.5 mil. So what it says about this is that um, basically around this time of the year, we know that excess oil is one of your skincare concerns. So bring things into balance with this oil absorbing pore minimizing gel. And you basically smooth a thin layer over your face after cleansing and before makeup. So that is great because I, especially around this time of the year when I'm eating a lot of cheese, drinking wine, eating all those foods, you know, you're not really supposed to have a lot of, um, this is a great thing to have. So I'm quite excited to try this and anything by benefit. I'm always pleased to have. I absolutely love that line. Um, moving on to number four, Percy and Reed. This is really cute. This, <laughs> look at the picture of this. This is actually a 30 mils, which is good because they do tend to give you only 15 mils. Um, it's really sweet with a little girl on it. And it says, um, I believe in miracles. 
Perfectly Perfecting Wonder Balm. What does it say about this? This is, this is, as they say, the creme de la creme, a miracle leave-in balm to be exact, which preps and primes your hair in readiness for all styling products and techniques. It makes your regular styling products work wonders, giving you more control and better results that last longer. So you basically just apply it to towel dry hair before you're gonna put your products in. I probably should have done that today. <laughs> um, I've just gotten out of the shower. Um, and it can also be worked sparingly into dry styled hair to maximize definition. So it looks like you just use a tiny, tiny little bit. Um, that's great. That's something I definitely use for sure. And I just think the company is just so sweet and it's just got such a London sort of feel to it. Um, so pleased with that. And what are we going on to? The last one is the skincare, which is the Birchbox exclusive. So every month Birchbox basically just chooses one item that's exclusive to their line and they match it up with the survey that you filled out with things that you're interested in. So um, this is a face scrub, which is good. I'm always happy to try new face scrubs. Um, gentle enough for daily use. Uh, this is a thick scrub. It's packed with rice powder to smooth and purify all skin types and is gluten free. So that's probably why they sent it to me because I did make note that I do tend to try and use gluten-free, excuse me, gluten-free face products as well as hair products because I have found I do have a reaction to it if there is gluten inside it. So I'm really excited to try this actually. Open it up. Ooh, smells strong. <laughs> Very minty. Um, you can see what it looks like inside. You can tell just by the texture and the thickness. It really is quite intense that. But anyway, I'm really pleased to do that. So just to recap, I got two makeup products. Where are they? So one, I got the full size eyeliner and then I also got the Laura Mercier little eye pencil or eye balm. Um, I got the pore to help minimize the pores. I got the Wonder Balm for my hair and I got the face scrub. So I am really pleased with December's Birch Box, which is good because guys, to be honest, I have been questioning whether I'm going to continue with Birch Box or not. But after seeing these products, I think I will definitely give it a go for another month or so. I am trying to simplify things in my life right now. So having loads of different little makeups and stuff can be a little bit overwhelming having too much stuff. But I am pleased um, with this month and I will definitely try um, for it, try it for next month and see what they bring me. So thank you guys for watching this short but sweet video. And if you do like watching my unboxings as well as my birch box unboxings, then please do hit the red button down below and give me a thumbs up and I'll see you guys soon for another video. Thanks guys. Happy new year.